Morning, my name's James. Welcome to the very first taking a walk with my best friend. Join me this morning, very chilly, but gorgeous, peak district. I'm currently walking from Cutthroat Bridge, just off the A57 Snake Pass. I'm heading up towards Winstone Lee Tor, and then back down to go along Lady Bar Reservoir, making a stop at Derwent Dam, which should be after the Seems like 137 years worth of rain we've had in the past few weeks. It should be tipping over. And then we're going to head back down towards Lady Bower Dam to see if the plug holes are tipping over too, which look, should look pretty spectacular. So we're about a mile into the walk now. Just coming up to Windstone Lee Tor. It's a nice steady walk from the car park. And with very little effort, you get a brilliant reward at the top. A spectacular view across Lady Bower. It is a bit windy up here, so apologies for the wind noise. But as you can see, Closer now down towards Lady Bower. As you can see, it's absolutely stunning. And the colours look amazing. You can keep it somewhere, I'll take autumn any day of the week. So we're just coming up now, just around this corner. Hopefully there's nobody in it. This little shelter for breakfast.
perfect. Had worse places. Worse places for our breakfast, I suppose. Gorgeous. So we've gone super basic today. What used to resemble coffee before I made it. And then some standard backpack issue cheese and pickle sandwiches. Which look like they've been hit by Haley's Comet at full blast, but there you go. So here we are. At the famous, famous Derwent Dam, as you can see, it's very much overflowing after all the rain we've had. Absolutely amazing, this, love it. So we're just heading back from Derwent Dam now. Got about another maybe two miles or so before we get to Lady Bower Dam. It's absolutely perfect morning. Peaceful, sunny-ish. 
not raining for once it's quiet for once on this path as well usually it's absolutely rammed so it's all good I mean, look at them colours up there look why would you not want to be out on a day like this look perfect absolutely perfect Come to the end of the long path coming from Derwent Reservoir and Derwent Dam. So now at the bottom end or the top end, whichever way you look at it, of Lady Bower. The fabulous Wind Hill up in the distance. Bamford Edge. So we've just got to cross, cross over the A57. towards Bamford now Wind Hill up in the distance Lady Bar Reservoir introduction about what I want this channel to be all about I suppose it's something I've been toying with doing for the past three or four years maybe um, but one of them things you keep putting off stupid reasons stupid excuses but we're here we're gonna give it a go so I'm very much learning learning as I go with it it's all totally new Totally out of my comfort zone, and I mean very, very much out of my comfort zone for those of you who didn't know me. And all this doing the thing to camera is just off a nightmares, really, but it's not so bad, really, once you get going. But what I want this all to be about is how all this ignore the telephone lines, not them. The outdoors can improve your well-being, 
your mental health, obviously your fitness. So that's what I want it to be about. It's not going to be all doom and gloom. I'm just going to try and process all the little ideas I've got in my head. At the minute it's about 30% ideas and imagination and 70% winging it as you can probably tell but hopefully once I get a bit more confident with this speaking to you guys maybe bring in a little bit of something to the many brilliant YouTube videos that there is on hiking and mental health and just general outdoor stuff everyone brings their own little thing so why can't I bring mine so that's me done end of a brilliant walk I think it was 10 10 and a half miles I think but I'll put the I'll put the route on I'll put the route onto this video so I'm sure it's 10 and a half miles yeah it's been brilliant absolutely brilliant so if you got this far thank you for watching and well done for not falling asleep listening to my monotone inane drivel and that's it for me I've got fresh socks the king of glove box snack finds and then now an hour and a half drive home so I'll thank you and I shall see you again soon on the next one hopefully